What is going on guys and welcome back to the season finale of the uh, Leicester City career mode series. We today are going to wrap up season number one and oh my days, the pressure couldn't have been any more intense to be brutally honest with you. Um, I mean, let's take a look at the board's objectives, should we? They wanted us to finish in a Champions League and uh, uh -uh, I'm afraid that didn't happen. We did, however, get through to the... Uh, Emirates FA Cup round of 16. We're in the final, in fact, which is coming up very soon. Continental success, win the cup, win the UEFA Europa League. Now we've got a chance to do that. We have a real chance against Leverkusen and that's our only way that we're gonna get into the Champions League. And guys, I gotta be brutally honest with you. The, the series is on the line. If we don't get through to the Champions League next season, I don't know if the series is gonna continue. So. You know, pressure doesn't get much bigger, games don't get much bigger. We're putting everything on the line here. Now, if we go into the calendar, actually, we've got... I mean, it's a bit stupid. I mean, why can't they space it out a bit more? But we've got Leverkusen on the Wednesday after Liverpool on the Saturday. I'm not sure it would happen like that in real life, but we don't have any choice. So we're just going to take it on the chin. We're going we're gonna to take on the challenge and hopefully... By the end of this episode, we'll be walking away with two huge shiny trophies under our arms. But there's still a lot of work to do before that can happen. It looks like we're going to have to play a bit of a weakened side against Liverpool, which is not what I always like to see. But before we even think about that, let's get into the press conference. Is fitness an issue here? Yeah, it is, to be honest, because we're going to have to play on Wednesday as well. Um, it's not the same for both teams either, but we've worked so hard to be here. That's That seems like the only option we really had there, to be honest, if we were going to be truthful. Might Liverpool get the better of you? I fancy our chances. Do I? I mean, especially as we just beat Liverpool, I doubt the game is going to let us beat them again. But <laughs> who knows, eh? Anything can happen in the cup. How can your team find consistency? It's about confidence. Well, our morale's good. Let, let's take that. So guys, this is what our team is actually gonna be looking like today against Liverpool. We've had to shuffle things up because oh, we just gotta prioritize that next match. But, you know, we've still got, our shuffled team is still pretty nice. I mean, to have Moutinho come in as a rotated player is a real luxury to have. And our, our fullbacks have a beastly stamina, so they can stay in, as well as Ndili. And Vardy uh, also starts up top. We might have to sub him at half-time, just to make sure he's okay for that match against Leverkusen. But oh, I just want to... Oh, we could be lifting a trophy in uh, within, within 90 minutes in-game. Oh, how good would that feel? How brilliant would that be for the series? But we're going to have to just focus... Focus our flipping faces off if we're gonna have any chances here. Back at Wembley again. We're getting we're getting used to it. It's becoming one of our second homes, but <sighs> Liverpool, they're no stranger to Wembley either, are they? And I'm pretty sure they're gonna want revenge for that last last match where we absolutely hammered them, but oh look at that. That is beautiful scenes, quite literally. Doesn't get any better than that. Half of the stadium is blue. Half of the stadium is red. It's going to be an absolute cracker, boys. They're, oh, they're singing You'll Never Walk Alone. Where's our song? What are we going to sing, guys? This isn't the biggest match of our season. The next match is going to be the biggest match of our season. But it sure as hell is a freaking ginormous match. Oh, look at that. It's so beautiful. I want it. Give it to me, please. Let's just get on with it. Come on, Zhao. Are you going to make the difference today, buddy? We'll have to see. But Jamie's going to kick us off here with that beautiful FA Cup ball. Oh, indeed, he is so good. How many tackles does he make in an average game? Too many is the answer. Okay, P's check looks a bit isolated here. Doesn't really know what he's supposed to do. So he'll find Fafana, he'll find Vindal. Gets it through to Moutinho, gets it through to Iose. Is Iose through? 
Can we take the lead? Oh, my words. Oh, why are you taking that with your left, buddy? Come on. Look at that. It couldn't have been any more straighter, Alison, if he tried. Ayose out here. Zhao finds Ayose again. Who's found a bit of space here. Oh, has he found Vardy? <laughs> Duh. That has absolutely rattled the bejeebas out of that post. That, that was brilliant play from us. Oh, I, I just... Get it away. I do not like this. Oh. Another throw in for them. I cannot be dealing with all this pressure. Come on, Fafana. Come on. Get us the ball back. Uh, okay, they work it back to Alexander-Arnold. To Salah. To Fabinho. But, our man... Indeed, he wins it back, but Salah must have 89 tackling if that's how he tackles, and he's clearly got 50 passing. Oh, the ref's got a blow, surely. There we go. It's been an extremely boring first half for a final. The crowd, they're going to want a refund if the second half is anything like this. We get it back to Iose. Hopefully he's not offside, but he's going to deliver a... Trash. Trash. That's the word. Trash cross. But we win it back. We get it through to Zhao. He's going to take the finesse. Straight down Allison's gob hole. Zhao. Oh, that's not... Oh, it's offside, isn't it? Oh. Come on. I think we're going to make some changes here. This is where Vardy's going to come off, I think. Save his legs for that Europa League game. Uh, Europa League final. It's not a game. It's a final. And who else? I'm not sure I want to bring on anyone else. Maybe I'll bring on Mendy for prayer, who's looking a bit tired, but we need to save legs. Br that didn't have any min- Oh, they've signed Lacazette. That's interesting. Alexander-Arnold launches it long here, but indeed he wins it. Sends it up to Greenwood. Who gets it through. To Under, that is beautiful stuff. Can he get the cross in? No, Robertson's going to block. And Allison collects the ball quite comfortably. comfortably. But we win it back again. How are we doing this? We get it through to Greenwood. We get it to... Oh, my word. Win it for us, Mendy! Oh, yes! That's the word. Yes! Get in there, Nampolis. Super sub. And we're in the lead in the FA Cup final. The FA Cup final. We're beating Liverpool. Oh, this... It, oh. So perfect. Such an unlikely hero as well. Oh. Buries it. Absolutely buries it like a striker. Look at the team. They love that. That's probably his first goal in the cup, to be honest. Yeah, it is. Up to Greenwood. Can he get it over the top? Oh, that's for Iose. Oh, Alexander-Arnold. I thought he was looking a bit tired there, but clearly not. Oh, and Didi, you beast. Oh, that's offside, isn't it? That was, yeah... That was so offside. Oh, he was into next week before I'd even passed that. Look at that. Brilliant play from me. Let's have a round of applause. Oh my, we've got to be careful here. Okay, Origi. It's up to no good down this right-hand side. Oh, win this, please. Indeedy. Um, hey, Bonucci. What's that going to be, ref? What's that going to be? Oh, it's going to be a warning. Just a warning? That looked a bit dangerous. Let's have a look. Oh, my days. That He's definitely taken the man out before he's got anywhere near the ball. Oh, brilliant. Okay. We've just might have just given them another chance before the end of the game. Oh, they're flooding men forward here. I don't like this one bit. 
Oh, yeah. Yes. We've won it. Let's just take a few minutes to appreciate these scenes, guys. Appreciate these scenes. I'm just going to shut up for a few minutes while we observe these beautiful, beautiful scenes. Our first silverware of the series. The first of many, hopefully. Here we go, here comes the big man, Casper, our club captain, well, he is now, and he's going to lift that trophy, which is blue, the FA Cup is blue guys, beautiful, absolutely indescribable moments happening here, moments of a lifetime, look at that, the fans are loving it. Casper, oh, go take it to the fans, mate. Way! Look at the fireworks during the day. Oh, that cup, it looks so good when it's blue, doesn't it? It just looks, looks, it looks right, doesn't it? Congratulations, yes lads! Our first silverware in the cabinet. Under our belts, first of many, hopefully. A great final and a huge achievement for Leicester City. You're right about that one, mate. How, how does that rank as an achievement? This is just the start. Oh, the players should like that, come on. Just one goal in it, are you happy with today's performance? Every player did his job. I'm sorry, are the players just, like, heartless? Do they not understand English or something? Why do they not like these responses? Did the Allison make it difficult for us today? Jeez, is he that good that he's now, like, the Allison? Like, the Terminator, the Allison. All right, um, hmm. We kept believing in ourselves. They don't like... The morale thingy must be broken, because I've given three positive responses there and it's not moved. Thanks so much for answering our questions. No problem, mate, but it was pretty pointless, wasn't it? And, people, it's it's time. And I know we've just won the FA Cup and we're, like, on cloud nine, but you know what, guys? I would actually... I would trade it all in for a win in this match. I would trade our sixth position in. I would trade my flipping house in to just get this win that's oh we need it so badly please i so want champions league next season let's get into the press conference can the team live up to expectations we've set our standards high that is for sure already have silverware in our cabinet can we win not the double but a double this season that would be amazing is fitness an issue we've worked so hard to be here Cool beans, cool beans. It was a narrow win. We've got goals in us for sure. Brilliant. Time to get into it, guys. Look at that. That is a beautiful sight. Full fitness, all our best players, no injuries. Couldn't have wished for any better circumstances. We've just got to go in there and get the result now. Oh, my word. We're at Borussia Park. It's the Europa League final. And it's live. Please just, yeah. Can't believe I did that. But they don't come any bigger than this, guys. Well, they do, the Champions League final. But they don't come any bigger than this this season for us anyway. Look at that. It's even more beautiful than the FA Cup. 
Oh. Come on, boys. I have faith in you. We just need a repeat of that performance against Liverpool. And we'll be in the Champions League. We'll be A for away. Win this, indeedy. Oh, okay. Perfection. Get this to Greenwood. Oh, my word. Get this to Vardy. Oh, oh he still gets it through. Vardy! Yes! Come on! Oh, my days. I need to calm down. We're only six minutes in. My days, Jamie, our hero. I think I just broke my chair. Oh my words. Look at that, I thought the chance had gone and oh, he just sweeps that home. Oh, I, I almost, I cannot believe it. <sighs> my heart is going at 500 miles an hour right now, but I need to remain focused, they're probably going to score. That They're, they're going to have chances for sure. We just need to hold our nerve. We need to score again. They work it out to Bender here. <laughs> Can't believe that's even a sentence. Get this to Madison. Oh, that wasn't how I envisioned it. Come on, Madison. Oh, okay. We need to be focused here. Okay, what are we going to do here? Oh, they equalise. Knew it was going to happen. Joseph Martinez. Have they signed him? Great signing for them. But, oh my words. I got a bit too excited early on, didn't I? It's not going to be that kind of match, is it? They're definitely going to have chances. Well, it's going to be a cracker. Let's just say that at can Vardy get it through to Barnes? Oh, that is that is delicious. But he's not got anyone up with him. Can he cross it in now, though, to get it to Ndidi? Oh, Madison sends it wide. Scuffed that a bit, didn't he? Get this to Vardy. Oh, he's in so much space. Vardy! He's, oh, he's hitting the crossbar. The crossbar. The keeper didn't even get anywhere near it. We're going to have to take some of these chances. Okay, they get it to Palacios here. Can Ndidi get it back for us? Oh, he can, but Vindal just plonks it straight back into their path. Brilliant stuff. Oh, Martinez has got free, and then he does that. Oh, just get this out. Get this to Ndidi who sends it forward. Get it over the top. Oh, okay, that is beautiful. We're countering here. What can we make of it? Get this to... Oh, score Madison! Oh, Sinkraven has blocked that. How has Madison not buried that? My grandma could have scored that, probably. Oh, and Didi, for one of the rare occasions, has been done... Oh, my word... Ricardo just got tackled, but luckily they fire it straight down Schmeichel's throat. Gets to, oh my word, what was that? Is it offside? Hold on a second. Oh, it's because he passes it against him. Oh, I was so lucky there. They are pressing us so high, putting us under so much pressure. Can we cross it in? Oh, the keeper's going to get that. That's going to be it for the half. I cannot, oh, I cannot be dealing with this. We've had so many chances, but we've only scored one of them. This is, you got to, we've got to hold our nerve. This is where, this is where teams are made in situations like this. Win this, Ricardo. Oh, win this, Canate. <laughs> okay, we get it to Greenwood. Surely we can counter a bit here. Oh, get it to Madison. He's got so much space. Madison! Oh yes! The keeper dived way too early there. And we take the lead. Oh my days. James Madison. Part of the Jamie duo. Oh, he, oh, such a professional finish. But the keeper, I'm sorry, he's had an absolute shocker. Look, he dives before I've even hit it. Oh my words. That is, that is out of the school of M. Gillespie, if you remember last episode 
M. Gillespie, basically, for those that don't know, was a uh, was the keeper for who was it? Newcastle, I think. When our youth side basically steamrolled them, oh, I'm pretty sure they could score score again. They've got such a deadly striker in Joseph Martinez. It wouldn't be that far fetched at all. Our oh, Tielemans gets done there. Oh, Soyuncu, you beast. How have you stopped that? Oh, can we counter here? Get it to... Okay, we get it to Ndidi. Back to Ndidi. Oh, mate, that has got to be at least a yellow. We're through there. We have two on one. Yeah, he wasn't quite the last man, but... That was a very cynical challenge, Aranguis. Look at that, the cheeky so-and-so. What does he think he's doing? And we give away a free kick. This is maybe where we make changes. We don't want to have too many tired players in our midfield. Maybe we bring in FA Cup hero Mendy for Madison just to give us that extra defensive support. Who else can we uh, bring into this match? Maybe Under comes on for Greenwood. That, that will do for now. We'll, we'll keep a substitution up our sleeve in case we have an injury or something because we cannot go down to 10 men. That would be actually disastrous. They get it out to Amiri. We're going to have to defend like flipping tanks in this last 10 minutes or 15 minutes. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, they get it out to Diaby. Oh, I cannot be dealing with this pressure. <laughs> Give me the ball. Oh, Tielemans gets it out for the corner. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take that. I'm not even talking, guys. I'm just like, ugh. Tunnel visioned onto my screen. My brain cannot function. Oh, uh, okay, just... Oh, it's my days. I can't even talk. That's how nervous I am. I thought it was pretty shocking in the end, but I thought it was better at first sight. Oh dear. Get back. Get back, Ndidi. Oh, win this, Soyuncu. Oh, oh my word. This is pressure. This is pressure. Oh, we've got out of shape here. Oh, that's offside. Yes, that's offside. I could even tell that. And if I can tell it's offside, it must be flipping miles. Look at that. Fell straight into the trap. Okay, and Didi, we've only got three minutes to survive here. That's all we've got to do. Oh. Oh, clear this. Oh, my days. Oh, my word. We deserve to be conceded against there. We... We deserve to concede. I don't know how Bailey has not finished that. He's such a good player. <laughs> I think we've just about done it, guys. Just boot this. Come on, ref. Come on. Yes! We are Europa League champions. And we've made it to the Champions League. Oh, I need to go have an ice shower. Oh, my days. This is this game is not good for my health guys it's actually not but two trophies in one episode you oh, that's the, that is actually the stuff dreams are made of we're dreaming we're flying high at the moment as a team and we have stormed our way into the champions league through the hardest possible route let's see our boys pick up the trophy Casper, he's getting used to the feeling. There we go, boys. Oh, I am one happy manager. So proud of the boys. Oh, 
look at them there. Europa League champions. I didn't give us a chance at the beginning of the season. And that looks better. Fireworks at night time. That is much better. Come on, let's have a final picture. That is, yeah, that, I have to say, that trophy is, uh, I don't know if it's as beautiful as the FA Cup now that we've actually won it, but it is a beautiful trophy. What a season for us. What an episode for us. Two trophies. It does not get any better, I promise. Look how even that match was. Look how even, oh, European glory. Thanks, Xbox. Six shots each, four shots on target each. But they dominated possession. Oh, such a close game. Who was the man of the match? Please tell me it was Jamie. Okay, apparently this game doesn't do man of the matches anymore. But Jamie Vardy, he was the man of the match. Let's be honest. Such a good player with Ndidi. Ndidi did a solid shift, as always, to be honest. But, oh my word, James Madison actually deserves a mention as well. To give us the winning goal... Yeah, let's do the press conference. Come on! I'm excited for a press conference for once. Oh, yeah. It's, it's, it's official. It's official, guys. We've, we've actually won it. I still pinch me now. I cannot believe it. There were so many better teams in there to beat us, but somehow we've done it. And uh, we'll see them in the Champions League next season. Great final and a huge achievement. It was a real team performance. For some reason, after the final, it doesn't change your morale. Don't know if that makes too much sense. I'm not sure anyone would have forecast such a dramatic end to the season. Me neither. Me neither. With the FA Cup and the Europa League, did you always think the double was within your grasp? It's a team, it's a team with spirit, isn't it? Absolutely. It doesn't matter what I could say. I could probably say, yeah, my players are all absolute trash. They need to go and learn a lesson how to play football and it probably still wouldn't do anything just one goal between the teams are you happy with the performance every player did his job no problem mate it is party time in the leicester city career modes so guys that wraps up an absolute roller coaster of a series oh my word we've won the double the double oh my word you couldn't have even i would have at the beginning of the season, if they had told me that, I would have absolutely snapped their hands off. But look at that. Mr. Ndidi. Standing with that beautiful trophy. Beautiful trophy. Oh, such a good season. But it wasn't looking good a couple episodes, was it? We were finishing sixth in the Premier League. Had no chance of Champions League. But look at us now. Look at us now. We're in the Champions League. We've won the... How many times am I allowed to say it? Is there like a sort of limit? But I'm going to say it one more time, guys. We won the double. And I'm so proud of the boys. I hope you guys will tune in for the very next season coming up extremely soon. Um, maybe before we go, we'll just take a look at the squad hub. I'll show you the players that are leaving at the end of the season. We, of course, have... Where's Morgan? He's had his farewell. Um, such a servant of the club. He will be severely missed. But then we have James, Yakupovic, Muskwe and Ndukwu who just... Yeah, they're not going to be good for us in the future, especially as a Champions League status team now. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Please celebrate with me by uh, smashing the subscribe button, hitting that notification bell so you know when season two begins. And, you know, please, guys, please, please, please leave a like rating on the video. That would help me get my channel out there, grow my channel. But also, guys, you know, you've got to smash a like. Surely we won the double. Please just, you know, we've got to, we've got to smash the like as a uh, observation of respect for the achievement of these beautiful, beautiful players at the end of this season. I hope to see you guys extremely, extremely soon. We'll probably be diving into season two tomorrow. Maybe, we'll see. But I hope you guys really enjoyed the video and until the very next time, have an awesome day because I know I'm gonna.